I love you. I love you. Temelate Openi was born on the 11th of June 1995 in Lagos, Nigeria to a Nigerian mother and a British Nigerian father. She moved from Nigeria shortly after birth to the UK before returning at five, after her parents divorced. Thames resided in Elupiju before moving to Lekki then Oja. Thames attended Dowen College for secondary education and Monash South Africa for her tertiary education. At school, she was noticed by her music teacher and learned to play the piano. She practiced singing with her brother and often used his guitar accompaniment. Thames' mother only allowed her to listen to Christian music when Thames was a child. Later in her teenage years, she became interested in R&B and hip-hop music. She listened to Destiny's Child, Beyonce, Lil Wayne, and Alia, and covered Alicia Keys' 2004 single, If I Ain't Got You, in a live performance. Growing up, she was also interested in artists such as Burner Boy, Lauren Hill, Adele, Rihanna, Coldplay, Paramore, and Asa. At the age of 15, she stopped listening to other artists in search of her own identity, because I wanted to learn how to attack a song from what I was feeling, not what Beyonce would do or anyone else. Her voice has been described as deep, velvety, and androgynous. In 2018, Thames quit her job to pursue a career in music. She began to learn self-production skills on YouTube and on the 18th of July 2018, she released her debut single, Mr. Rebel, a song which she produced by herself. On the 7th of August 2019, she released the single, Try Me. In 2020, DJ Edu chose her as one of 10 arti artists to watch that year. On the 23rd of April 2020, Thames was featured alongside fellow Nigerian singer David O on a reworked version of American singer-songwriter Khalid and English electronic music duo Disclosure single, Know Your Worth. On the 25th of September 2020, Thames released her debut extended play, Four Broken Ears. It was produced primarily by her and the single Damages from the EP became another follow-up hit to Try Me, peaking at number one on the Nigerian Apple Music chart and number six on the then newly launched Turntable Top 50 chart and garnering 5 million views on YouTube. On the 30th of October 2020, Thames was featured on fellow Nigerian singer Whiskey's single, Essence, from the latter's fourth studio album, Made in Lagos. The song earned her a number one spot on BBC One Extra Airplay chart. And also earned her first career entry on Billboard Hot 100 at number nine. Thames won a Soul Train Music Awards, two NAACP Image Awards, and received a Grammy Award nomination for Best Global Music Performance. On the 8th of November 2020, Thames was included in the Future Awards Africa, Class of 2020. On the 13th of August 2021, a reworked version of Essence, which contains an additional feature from Canadian singer Justin Bieber, was released, which propelled the song to reach number 9 on the Billboard Hot 100. On the 3rd of September 2021, Thames was featured on Canadian rapper and singer Drake's song, Fountains, from the latter's sixth studio album, Certified Lover Boy, which debuted at number 26 on the Hot 100. On the 15th of September 2021, Thames released her second extended play, If Orange Was a Place, after being signed to RCA Records. 
It was primarily produced by Guilty Beats, and the single Crazy Tings was released five days before and peaked at number three on the UK Afrobeat singles chart. Later, Thames reached number one on the Billboard Next Big Sound chart and the Billboard Emerging Artists chart. On the 14th of December 2020, Thames was arrested alongside fellow Nigerian singer Omar Lay after they performed in a show in Uganda. The Ugandan police authority identified violation of COVID-19 lockdown protocols as the reason for their arrests, but the two artists felt they were set up. Two days later, the Ugandan government released them, apologized for the arrests, and dropped the charges. On the 31st of March 2022, Apple Music One launched leading Vibe radio show with Thames. On the 2nd of April, its first episode features an appearance from Muiwa Awani and Tunji Balagan. On the 29th of April 2022, Thames was featured alongside Drake on American rapper Future's single, Wait For You, from the latter's ninth studio album, I Never Liked You. The song debuted atop the Hot 100, making Thames the first African female artist to top the chart and more so debut atop the chart. The song samples the song Higher from For Broken Ears. In July 2022, Thames covered Bob Marley's No Woman, No Cry for the Marvel movie Black Panther, Wakanda Forever soundtrack which she was credited alongside Rihanna. On the 26th of July, Thames gained her fourth Hot 100 with her song Free Mind from For Broken Ears debuted on the chart. In July 2022, Thames was announced as a guest artist on Beyoncé's album Renaissance, collaborating on the song Move with Grace Jones, becoming her fifth entry on the Hot 100. In October 2022, she co-wrote Rihanna's song Lift Me Up for the Black Panther, Wakanda Forever soundtrack. Thames, Ludwig Göransson, Rihanna and Ryan Coogler were nominated at the 2023 Golden Globe Awards for Best Original Song, Motion Picture, for Lift Me Up from the film Black Panther, Wakanda Forever. In 2023, Thames, Future and Drake won the Grammy Award for Best Melodic Rap Performance for Wait For You. Thus, it marks the first female Nigerian artiste to win a Grammy Award.